Oh, man. See the games. <laughs> Hello, hello. Today's video, I'm doing Lucy's second seven minute workout. And I haven't checked out any of the workouts to see how it is, but today's my day one. I don't know if I'll do it for the whole seven days, but if I do, I'll update you. If I don't, yeah, that's just it. <laughs> All right. And if you guys haven't yet checked out the first video that I did of her first seven minute workout, I'll link it in the description box or somewhere up here, you know, somewhere. Just check it out and I will see you soon, guys. Wish me luck. You're only doing these moves once today. Then straight back down to the ground. Then you're coming up and then take that to that knee lift, knee lift. It is a good idea if you've got a mat or do that on a carpet at home. If you're a beginner following me on the left, you're gonna do a little squat, then you're gonna reach up tall and take alternating knee lifts on there. So that's good. So we're halfway through, 30 seconds, keeping that going. Both these moves are really good for conditioning and strengthening through your abdominals. So how this workout works today, we are doing what I call cardio tone. So we're not doing things like planks or sit-ups because that's not, not how we strip off belly fat. We have to do ultimate calorie burning to do that and we're doing that by toning also with these moves. All right, and we've got last four seconds. Let's go three, two, and one. We're gonna do 30 seconds one leg, then switch to 30 the other. So kick it up high, jump it back, touch the ground. If you're a beginner or you don't want the high impact, literally just kick that leg up and then step the opposite one behind, that's good. So keeping that going, at the 30 second point, we're gonna change. And the beauty of this workout, you can do it with your friends, doesn't matter what fitness level you're at, this suits everyone. All right, that's good, let's keep that going. Not long now on that leg, this one is a toughie. Today's workout is super hard. We've got three, let's go two and one. Let's now just change legs, so you're gonna kick forward with the other leg and step back. And if you do want full support, support sorry, then do go and join our amazing Facebook group. It is just full of really positive people helping each other on their health, fitness, a lifestyle journey. So that's um, Facebook Lucy Squad. All right, keep that going. You've got last 10 seconds now. Kick that leg high if you're doing it on the right. Keep that focused. And let's go five. Take it four. Go three, two, one and one. This one is really hard on balance. If you're following on the left, I just want you to do one of each and don't take the leg as high. So we do two knee pull downs and then two leg lifts. Keep it on the same leg. So this really works your balance as well as working the abdominals. Halfway through, we're gonna change, take that to the opposite leg. So the benefit here is we are still keeping that heart rate up, so we're increasing your metabolism, which just means then we're helping burn off excess body fat, but we're also toning and strengthening through your abs at the same time. Doing really well, let's keep going, that's good. And this one's really good for your coordination and balance. All right, let's change, take that to the other side now. So if you're following on the right, remember that is the harder variation. It's two knees and then two legs out to the side. Two knee pull downs and then two leg lifts out to the side. If you're following on the left, then we're just doing one of each. Tap it out, knee in, and always keep those abdominals tight. You're doing really well, and we've just got last five seconds coming up now. So let's go five, take it four, three, two and one all right so we are now on the next move coming up now this one is super tough plie squats and then you're going to pulse it so if you're falling on the right try and land softly i said this really tough but just think you're only doing this move once so count yourself once you've done 10 hold it and take it to 10 pulses so you're then pulsing that for 10 once you've done your 10 pulses, take it straight back to that crossover plie jump. If you're following me on the left, then just bring it back to that full range. So you're going all the way up and down. And if you are on Instagram, if you're not already, then definitely come and follow me for daily motivation and just let me know how you're getting on and you can message me and also post up on Instagram if you're doing this workout, if you're taking on that challenge. All right, that's good. Keeping that going, you've got now less than 15 seconds to go. We are flying through this workout. You are gonna feel amazing. Think of the benefits. We are gonna get incredible results. Okay, that's good. Let's go last five. Let's go four. Take it three. Yes. 
Two star jumps, two knees up on there. So this one here is what I call plyometric moves. So we are really increasing that heart rate and because we're doing that, we're increasing your calorie burn. And it's the same on the left here. The people that are following on the left, it's still a challenging workout, all right, but it is just you're not doing any of the jumping on there. That's good, so let's keep that going. And let's look at the bigger picture here. We are actually now, you and I are both investing in your health. And I keep doing these seven minute belly workouts because I've just had the most incredible results. The first one I launched last year has had already over 33 million views and just the most amazing results. So you can always do that one on top of this one. All right, that's good. So let's just keep that going. You've got last 10 seconds coming up now. Feel that challenge. Remember, this is where you are getting fitter and stronger. Exercise is medicine. Never ever forget that. Four, let's go three. Take Take it two and one amazing so we have just got two moves left come up then step the foot back opposite foot back so 60 seconds choose your move so you've got the low impact on the left or the harder one on the right that's good so we jump down jump the feet out come back up and then straight back down that's good and then step it back so a lot of people think if they want to lose belly fat they spend like a minute or two minutes doing the plank doing floor sit-ups but actually the best way to do it is by doing these standing exercises and also the other thing that's so important if you're looking to strip belly fat is nutrition that is key that's why I do advise if you're doing this challenge it's so important to look at healthy eating avoid processed foods we don't want stuff with sugar it's about just eating clean eating the right size portion. You've got 15 seconds to go. March on the spot. Then once that hits 10 seconds, we are going to do squat jumps. You jump from one side to the other for 10 seconds or do step taps. That's good. All right. And keeping that going. So really putting 100% effort. This is your last exercise today. You can do it. Think of those benefits that you are going to get. This would be amazing if you can do this workout first thing in the morning because you're going to feel incredible for the rest of the day. So get ready now and take that to those jumps. If you're following me on the right or if you're following on the left, do those toe taps, traveling that across. And if you are wanting some, if you are, sorry, looking for a more in-depth weight loss program then I do have my 21 day courses one specifically for women and one for men again I'll put all these on my website all right that's good we are nearly done and let's go for it last five seconds from now go four take it three two and one <laughs> So let's go into doing some stretches now and what I want you to do is just take that one foot behind, feel the stretch through the back of the lower leg. If you want longer cooling down, hit the pause button, carry a marching on the spot, you can always grab some water as well. If not, we'll just go through doing these stretches. Let's now take that to the opposite leg, so you're just going to take that behind, keep the heel down. Oh man, can you see the sweat on me? <clears throat> it's very intense. I also think it's because it's my first, it's my first day. Oh man! See the gains. <laughs> All right, guys. So that was the workout that I just completed. As you can see on this. Um, Last time, I had much more stamina. I think my form was much better as well. In terms of fat, I can't say like an exact, I didn't do any measurements because I don't want to fixate on numbers. But what I do use to determine is my stamina, my fitness level, my endurance, you know, that kind of thing. And so, yeah, this is the end. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.